Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, and in this video I'm going to be reviewing the film, The Marvels. Yes, I just finished watching The Marvels on Disney+, Plus. it came out today. Uh, the movie was released on November 10th, 2023. It is a superhero film, and the 33rd film in the MCU. It has an average grade of a B on CinemaScore. It has a 5.6 out of 10 on IMDb and a 62% on Rotten Tomatoes. The movie had a $275 million budget, only made $200 million at the box office. Well, the movie was directed by Nia DaCosta and stars Brie Larson, uh, Tiana Paris, Iman Vellani, Zowie Ashton, Samuel L. Jackson, uh, with appearances by a couple special people, which I'm not going to spoil if you haven't seen the movie. The uh, end credit scene is uh, really good as well. Um, but in this movie, we have Captain Marvel, Miss Marvel, and Monica Rambeau, who we later known to be, I would assume, Professor Marvel. I'm assuming. I don't know. I don't know the comics. Uh, but that sounds like a great name anyway. But those three are responsible for taking on Darbin, who is trying to exact revenge against Captain Marvel for what she done in her past, as she was known as the Annihilator to her and her people. So, yeah, a long story short, three against one. That's what it is. Um, the, the, the the villain, Darwin, was was really good. Um, I probably have her in the top, I'd say the top half of villains as far as the MCU goes. Um, I love the characters, the three superheroes. The standout to me, though, uh, is Miss Marvel. I think she was an absolute delight. And, uh, yeah, this this was a really good movie. I haven't given it a grade yet. I'm still thinking about it. I'll give that to you here shortly. But I, I love the characters. Love seeing Nick Fury. Um, my favorite scene in the movie is when they're on the planet Aladna where it's pretty much all water, like 96% water planet. And when they have to do a singing routine to basically communicate with the people, which I think was hilarious. And again, Miss Marvel stood out because she was having the most fun her character was anyway. And uh, it was nice to see uh, Captain Marvel kind of loosen up a little bit too. But yeah, overall, though, this this was a fun movie, I have to say. It, it's not it's not in the top ten. I don't know exactly where I'm going to put it. But it's definitely one of my favorites that I've seen recently, considering we got, you know, Ant-Man, uh, the Quantum Realm, and a couple others. But other than that, I have... I don't have a lot of issues with the movie. The one thing I really did enjoy is they got right into the movie. They didn't mess around. And this was one of the shortest, I think the shortest Marvel movie we've gotten. Uh, with an hour uh, hour and 33 minutes as when the credits started rolling. Of course, we had, typically with the Marvel movies, we had the end credits and we got that. So I would say maybe an hour and 36 minutes total with the end credit scenes. Yeah. And I, I the one end credit scene that I really enjoyed is going to lead up to another team, if you if you will. I'm really looking forward to that, see what kind of team they put together. Uh, there's a lot I don't know about these comics and everything. So... Uh, I don't know what to expect. All I know is I'm a fan. I love watching the movies. And with Marvel, there's only been one stinker, in my opinion. And you'll see what it is when I redo my 
um, my ranking for Marvel movies. Now, this year, I believe we're only having Deadpool 3, if I'm not mistaken. You know, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think that's the only one we're getting this year. But as far as this movie goes, I think it's solid, and uh, I recommend you check it out. I'm going to give the Marvels <sighs> tearing back and forth between two numbers. <sighs> I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10 and two thumbs up. That's right. I said it, a 9 out of 10. Love it, hate it, I don't care. That's my score. So in the comment section below, if you've seen the movie, give me your thoughts and opinions. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Hit that notification bell, and if you like the review, hit the like button. Also, stay tuned for my uh, uh, ranking of the Marvel movies. I will have that video out here sometime this week. But look forward to that and many more movie reviews, and I'll see you guys in the next one.